Hi Ashwin. Hi Nova. Welcome to Tollywood. Hello <laughs> 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 on the feeling Hyderabad cinema. Feeling chala baundi. Chala baundi. Chala baundi. Manam idhar actually I am from Karnataka. You are from Chennai. Yeah. Bangalore Chennai. Bangalore Chennai. Meeting Pakana in Hyderabad. Pakana. Yeah. <laughs> Talking Telugu. Yeah. Nice. Feels good. Okay. So, Abba, we'll do one thing. We'll make our uh, conscious talk. Co- conscious talk? Yeah. Means? Now, you're not the actor. Uh, the actor in you is not talking. Okay. Okay. Huh. Now the, oh, you want? Oh, you want like? Okay, cool. Now the conscious you is talking. Conscious me talking. Okay, mm. you also talk, you also going to be talking conscious. Yeah, yeah. So okay. I'm going to ask questions. So uh-huh. <laughs> you need to. <laughs> uh-huh. Okay, fine, fine. All right. Why did you say yes to darling? For you. Huh? Yes, for you. Yes, for me. Yes. <laughs> it's not just the story. It's just it, it's also the way you presented it. Hmm. The the day you came, you remember? I have told you hmm. told this to everybody a hundred times. on the camera and off the camera hmm. that the way you came and narrated it from from the moment you sat on the chair hmm. and you told no i'm going to stand and narrate hmm. then i'm like oh okay this is new hmm. <laughs> and that two and a half hours hmm. without a break <laughs> 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 so and we had i ordered coffee and i'm like we are doing all of those things you didn't even touch your coffee with the the kind of passion and the kind of energy and the way you had that intonation for every single characters in the movie hmm. i could literally picture other characters also not just hmm. mine hmm. so i'm like see it's not just the story what uh, hmm. people bring to you it's also the confidence of a person who could execute it so i did absolutely say yes to you okay thank you that's a good compliment why did you say yes to me <laughs> um the moment because i like you told told that you went to Kan- kashmir to kanyakumari yeah yeah i have been everywhere in search of people to yeah in search of people in search of new talents in search of established talents everywhere yeah but nobody had that attitude that you had okay attitude attitude is i wa- I, i always thought because you said yes immediately yeah you didn't make me or the team wait you said immediately and it was like you you said it like you do it day in and day out and i still i asked sunny and sitaram are she is done any acting oriented roles or what <laughs> 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 because for me for me for me nabana tesh was a star heroine yeah, who, yeah. Who, who did mainstream films yeah, yeah. who danced exceptionally well yeah, who yeah. wore great clothes yeah. you know this was the this was the yeah. uh, impact or the impression which was available but actually even though my movies are all commercial mm. my characters have become famous exactly that's where that, yeah. that's where i'm coming to yeah okay cool. <laughs> so out of nowhere i see one kannada film in that you portrayed a role which you didn't show you you didn't show that part of naba to the telugu audience yeah 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 so if i first thought okay this girl is saying okay she just got excited she she enjoyed the film like an audience yeah, like yeah. how audience see the film they enjoy they yeah. like are super yeah. like that she saw it i think okay let me see anyway she has to come for workshop and all so yeah. that time <laughs> she will feel <laughs> that, <laughs> that time i thought you will feel are endukrana ee cinema ni okay chep like that i thought you will think yeah. uh, but it didn't happen also one more thing um, like an actor who's been here i think for 3 between 3 to 5 years in telugu yeah. cinema yeah Okay. 5 to 6 years 5 to 6 years minus corona and everything okay so you so you have seen uh, biggest of biggest blockbusters and everything in in your in your 5 to 6 year career yeah, yeah. Uh, do when someone approaches to you do you think for a girl who's an actor to grow big or to become a star it does her co-star also matter or does the content and her character matters it definitely depends on the setup okay it definitely de- depends on the setup like what am um, what are you offering me mm. like in this movie you offered me the kind of role and range no movie or no commercials or like the biggest of biggest biggest setup has offered me mm. so i am both an actor i am both a commercial person because i love dancing i love dressing up well because i'm a model mm. i love fashion i love everything 
So wherever whatever is offered to me, hmm. whichever at that specific time, whatever I think that it's going to work for me, hmm. I take it up. And it should also like make me feel better. I, it should also like make me feel entertained. It shouldn't bore me basically. Hmm. <laughs> like <laughs> there was one or two movies where I got really bored because I didn't have anything to do. <laughs> I didn't have dance to do. I didn't have like good like you know. It was just I was just there. Hmm. Every time something bores me extensively, I'll stop doing it. I'll stop doing movies. Mm. So basically, after my shoulder injury, whatever happened, I kept kept getting that repeated kind of a thing because everybody were basing the offer on my previous work, okay. which was in two thousand nineteen, two thousand twenty, mm. which was pre Corona, mm. where industry was also just enjoying commercial films. But mm. now it is not that way. Mm. audience are evolved audience are like consuming different kind of content people are like really loving where their actors or where their filmmakers are coming and giving some exceptional crazy mad stuff hmm. and you came and gave me crazy mad <laughs> stuff i am like oh my god this is what i wanted so that's that what is your most favorite food spot in hyderabad okay before you tell that i have one doubt okay. <laughs> i've heard lot of female actors say Diet, diet, diet. When in the set and all, they will eat fruits, they will eat salad and all that. What did you think I did? No, I am asking you. <laughs> like, is it for real that you don't? When you are in Hyderabad, uh, you can't, like, you you can't take your eyes off from biryani shops going here and there. I eat and lot of eateries. So I, I want eat. to understand: I, is <laughs> is diets really real or is it? It a is myth? extraordinarily hundred <laughs> percently God promise, universal <laughs> promise, real. <laughs> It's okay. not a myth. It is real. So you don't crave for midnight biryani. See, because you know what, I love food. Hmm. I'm a food lover like you are. Hmm. Like I can sit and talk about food passionately hmm. about oh that leg piece with really good meat tenderloins and all that I can talk. Hmm. But what was happening to me with that is that I was passively craving for food. Hmm. So what happens is when you're working out, when you're like doing gym lifting weights and all that. Hmm. If you do that, if you keep cheating, your progress is not coming. Mm. It's basically very painful, Ashwin. Gym is very painful. <laughs> What is number one test diet? Hmm. Morning first thing is coffee. Coffee, so it's a set property. It's there with you from and, and yeah, I think like until I you sleep. Like yeah. <laughs> Then I probably eat some eggs in the morning. Okay. Then I eat some bland fish and some vegetables. Okay. Then uh, again, some chicken and vegetables, maybe some rice in the middle. But I love food. Hmm. You know what I did? Am I looking not? Am I not looking good in the movie? Yeah, I'm you really are. Good. Uh, so <laughs> six or seven or eight months back, what hmm. I did, did is I broke up with food. Hmm. I said I'm breaking up with you because hmm. you're not, you're not, you know, doing good for me hmm. because I love you so much. Hmm. Then I keep going back to you. But it is not like look. I am not looking good. Hmm. So I am like I broke up with the food. I stopped talking about the food. Okay. I stopped consuming food. I still eat. But now it is more like when you ask for me about the craving, hmm. it's more like uh, like imagine like your ex boyfriend or girlfriend. Like you don't think about it so that you don't crave for it. So But it's always good to think about ex boyfriend or girlfriend. No, no, it's <laughs> not. <laughs> do you think so? Ah, uh, I do because Shreya. <laughs> no, because. Uh, See, we had school loves very small when we were kids, no. So it's always it's it, it's. You good. had uh, girlfriends when you were in uh, school. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Oh, really? Yeah. When when was your what was your first girlfriend uh, and what at what age? No, no, people will judge me. <laughs> no, 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 come on. <laughs> uh, I think when I was in my seventh or eighth grade. <laughs> really? Oh God! Yeah. You remember her name? <laughs> okay. Okay. No names. But, Fine. Uh, but no then, names. No names. But, but details. That, that's that's a really cute one. You know, what do you think we'll do out of love? We'll bring one extra chapati from our house, oh, okay. or she will bring one extra vegetable from our house, uh. or her homework I'll do, or my homework. Oh. She'll. That's all. That now 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 when I'm telling this, <laughs> it sounds interesting, no? Uh-huh. It sounds so happy, it bringing smile yeah, to your face. Yeah, yeah. No? So it's good, no, to think about it. No, but you know what? Like my childhood was not as uh, cool and happy and easy <laughs> as yours. I mm. I was like somehow imposed myself with stressful situation. Mm. I was like I I kind of made myself that I have to like go and. 
perform well, hmm. get prizes, huh. get score 95 every every single exams. Hmm. So I had like a very stressful childhood. Hmm. So I don't I don't remember having a boyfriend at the age of seven or even like 17, 18. Oh. That came later on okay. in life. So mine is like you know, it is painful. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so with, with, with respect to darling, you have three options. Okay, either you have to, you want to give a gift to someone. Okay, or you want to call and scold someone. Okay, or you want to say thank you to someone. These three things from the cast and crew of darling for whom you want to do. All of these things I have to do. Yeah, these three things, each should be one one person. I have to say immediately or I can think about it? No, no, it. immediately. Rapid fire. Oh, or, shit. <laughs> or, or else I'll take Thank you, that. Ashwin. <laughs> I'll take Thank the... you so much. Um, call and scold. I'll probably call my manager saying that what is this? Hmm. I've not had enough sleep. <laughs> I want to sleep. <laughs> That's the scolding they'll get. Huh. Gift, I'll send it to Darshi. Because he gifted me one cute uh, Wonder Woman hmm. uh, kind of a figurine. Huh. I think I have to gift him back. Super. It's pending. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Scolding will always be manager. My people. Hey, you're polite. Yeah. You, you, you. Same. Repeat. Repeat. Okay. Uh, I also give gift to Darshi. Okay. I'll thank you. Oh, okay. You're copying my answers, Ashwin. <laughs> no, I'll thank you. Okay, okay. Thank you okay. is I've taken. I'll thank you. Scold. Who can we scold? Sitaram. <laughs> scold. I'll probably scold Pradeep. Our Why? Editor. Why? He cut the film so well that he's taking all credits. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Everything, they say that like everything you do actually is finally decided on the table mm. when it is gone to the editor. The way he sees also the film, sees the film also is very important as you've seen it. Correct. And everybody else has seen it. So, Pradeep, <laughs> it's okay. You take it. <laughs> you take the credit. <laughs> Let him scold you, but like, thank you. <laughs> also, every set will have one. Kind of gossips going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Something or the other we'll hear. Did our set have gossips? That's what I'm coming to ask you. <clears throat> what is that weird gossip that you heard in our set? Any any gossip that you heard in our set? Okay, Ashwin, I'll ask you one question, okay? Mm. Do you think you gave me enough time to listen to the gossips? <laughs> <laughs> in this movie, <laughs> did I have time to even think about anything else? Huh. You have to tell me now, like I'm free. Hmm. After the shoot and everything, now uh, I'm like sitting hmm. all years. Uh, because when I was sitting and listening to you uh, in hmm. yesterday's interview, hmm. which I absolutely didn't know, uh, I'm like, oh, all of this happened. I didn't even know. Because <laughs> as soon as I got into Inter this uh, hmm. uh, movie, I have a confession to make actually. Hmm. I was fearless in hmm. the uh, in the narration. Hmm. I was very excited. Hmm. And we decided that we're going to do a lot of... Uh, uh, workshop and everything. Workshop was fun. I really had fun with you guys and like mm. everything. Post that, mm. when the shoot was happening, I was super freaking scared. Mm. I was scared. I was anxious. I was nervous. Mm. I was all things but brave because mm. I know I knew for the fact that oh my god, now I have to deliver. Mm. Till now it was all preparation and everything. Mm. Now it is happening. Now it is taking like you know coming to life and you also. During the workshop, you were like, now my work is done. I'm mm. just like going to witness my artist do mm. everything. I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? So, you've seen me like on the set, mm. not leaving you guys. <laughs> yeah. I was just in the set when you're lighting, when you're like, are uh, when you're like, they literally used to move that mm. cot along with me because I didn't move because I wanted like that <laughs> indirect support and like, huh, we are there kind of a situation. I didn't have time for gossip session. Tell me, what is the gossip you heard? I've heard a lot of gossips. Every day one one will come. Okay, tell me. Something or the other. What is the, what is like the topmost which kind of you thought was entertaining? Yeah, topmost was one day my AD came and told 
today like today for lunch sir we are not getting from production abba ma'am ma'am has sat and cooked biryani <laughs> i was like okay when did she, when did she do that sir poddu nunchi aa pani e jarutundi sir okay but i started <laughs> shooting at 7:38 when did she do i was thinking so i didn't want to ask you okay because i thought what if you had planned something else and i ask you and you are like oh should i do it or not that kind of situation will come so i didn't ask you but really biryani came i was so shocked i was tasty and it was tasty <laughs> i thought really naba only cooked for a moment <laughs> then after some time our manager aston manager he brought one 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 man said uh, sir you like the biryani yeah, he only cooked it then i looked at their faces <laughs> what you said naba cook no no sir naba madam only told to cook hey told ekkada ra word ekkada ekkada ra oh that's the gossip so that is that one, the gossip yeah that would have been a very interesting gossip like yeah nenu almost 100 members ki food unta cheyadam ante it was it was a very good uh, very good gesture from you you know no, it's always uh, we can't make people say enough through through any means yeah except food food yeah 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 mm. Yeah but so people was, will be happy and content only through food but because you this movie made me so happy hmm it was not like nen nen em antunnaru ante ee cinema it was not just like any other movie i've shot hmm i've told you this after the movie really hmm. uh, like after we finished the shoot also hmm every day hmm i've gone to bed after the shoot hmm i've gone with a smile on my face thank you because this movie made me happy the people made me happy ఎందుకంటే ఈ సినిమాలో ఆనెస్ట్లీ నేను చెప్పాలంటే ద కైండ్ ఆఫ్ క్రియేటివ్ కొలాబరేషన్ ఐ హ్యాడ్ విత్ విచ్ ఐ హ్యాడ్ విత్ యూ నరేష్ అండ్ ఎవ్రీ ఎవ్రీబడి ఐ హెవ్ నాట్ హ్యాడ్ ఇట్ బిఫోర్ లైక్ ద కైండ్ ఆఫ్ డిస్కషన్ వీ యూస్ టు డూ బిఫోర్ వీ యూస్ టు గో ఆన్ ద షార్ట్ అండ్ స్పెషల్ యూ రిమెంబర్ ద ద మోస్ట్ ద సీన్ విచ్ వీ బోత్ వెర్ స్కేర్డ్ అబౌట్ యూ రిమెంబర్ హౌ వీ కెప్ ప్రొలాంగింగ్ దట్ సీన్ i have to tell there is one scene in the movie which we both knew was very difficult i think everybody mm. knew that it was the most difficult scene workshop chesina appudu kuda manam we kept uh, doing that scene the most and we kept it for the second schedule second schedule lo 3 days oka set lo manam pettukunamu uh 3 days or 4 days 4 days 4 days pettukunamu dantlo second day is what we kept that scene and i was not well during mm. that time తర్వాత ఐ కాల్ అశ్విన్ నాకు ఎంతసుంది ఇట్ వాస్ నాట్ స్కేర్డ్ బట్ ఇట్ వాస్ మోర్ లైక్ దే సే దట్ యు కీప్ ప్రలాంగింగ్ టు ఫేస్ సంథింగ్ విచ్ యు ఆర్ మోస్ట్ ఆంక్షియస్ అండ్ ఫ్యూర్ ఫ్యూర్ అండ్ ఐ మీన్ ఇట్స్ సంథింగ్ ఇట్స్ డిఫికల్ట్ ఇట్ ఈస్ డిఫికల్ట్ టు ఫేస్ దట్ వాస్ హ్యాపనింగ్ టు మీ అండ్ దెన్ థర్డ్ డే వీ పుష్ డెట్ and then you called and said naba put it to 10th fourth day <laughs> like, oh, thank you <laughs> fourth day then we don't have choice we have to do mm-hmm. it so but you remember that scene we actually kind of um, rehearsed fully fully for fully. two hours or one and a half two hours two hours yeah and um, we were doing it all of that and i remember very specifically there was one jump <laughs> we wanted but we were not getting, getting it. it and then hemant comes and says mm. that what if you just like go down no, and come no. up and we just got it i mean see like that is something which excites me as a person correct as an actor you ask me what excites mm. you like this is the process and the filming is what excites me and that is the most memorable time for me <laughs> rest everything now audience are going to enjoy it in trailer everything is happening that was like so good i had like a lot of fun okay so after the trailer i've got a lot of dms okay okay uh, in the trailer there is a switch portion no mm. me uh, like do you like me do you love yeah, me? Yeah, yeah. that portion so what a lot of people are asking me is is it two different shots that we have stitched yeah so i think i want to show people a 10 second in in real time that 10 second yeah okay yeah okay. oh you oh you want me to do that yeah. now ha ah, i should have written and come <laughs> okay we'll do it what do you want you can you 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 can become adi whenever you want we'll keep talking you become adi oh god <laughs> <laughs> ha hmm 
Okay. To talk to me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I am. I am talking to you. <laughs> this is seeming like workshop all over again. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, Sita Ram wanted some controversy in the interview. Mm. So I thought, okay, what controversy can we make? What controversy do you want to make? <laughs> I, I, I don't know. So you, you want any controversy to be created? Ain't it? Sinmal Jaisen is up there. Inka malle malle jaya la. Ikur kuda acting jaya la manam. Cheste. Huh? Chahi andi ma'am. Okka payment ke ani Sinmal Jaisen da mandi manam. Ma'am chahi andi ma'am. Promotional kuda acting jaya la. Huh? Ah Sinmal kuda jaya la. Chahi andi ma'am. Endu ko? Endu kante. Idi me Sinma ne kada? Sinma ante? Sinma ante? Ashwin nak chala akle sunja Ashwin. Baba, why did you say you are not doing the promotion? I didn't say I am not doing the promotion. You just said. I did not say it. You only told now. Ashwin, I am sitting in front of you, Ashwin. I am sitting coffee, I am sipping coffee, I am not eating from morning. I am coming and promoting the film, darling, darling, I am saying everywhere, Hyderabad, Motkam, Tirge, Sochcha, Nenin, Kain, Jayali. No, no. You only told now. Everybody saw. Ain't he? चपतार लग रहा था मेरे को नहीं ना कब बांटा चपता अश्विन जनाल की अंत चेसी ना अंते अश्विन मानम चेसे चेसी ने उंडा लेने अनकुट ढूंढा रहा मानग अंत यार पटा कोड़ा दो मानग ये इनका वाला चेस को नहीं लिखो दो उंडा अंतर मैडम मेरे पेरेंट ही ना पेरेंट ही था लेता चपण्डी मैडम पेरेंट ही सिक्स मंथ्स तो जी शूटिंग जैसे ना मंडी इनका पैर आड़ तो ना रहेंटे इधि नबाना आदिया आनंदिया ना पेरो आदि ओके आदि केम कावले आदि की अपुर्ण किस्ता मोच्तो अपड़ोस्तो उन टा दे एम कावले एम कावल कोड़ा दानी मेराड़गा कोड़ा दांते लेह दंडे दर्ज का दा मनातो इंगला उन टा दे आदि की डार्लिंग्स इन मतलब सा ओह माय गॉड अश्विन दिस सच अ क्यूट पिक्चर आई लव दिस वन I love this poster. When are we releasing the other pictures? Other other posters? It will come very soon. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait to see the movie. What do you want when to tell the audience? When are you seeing? When are you showing the movie? You, you want to see it with the audience? I want to see it alone. I think I should see it alone. You know what happened to me during the trailer uh, launch? I blacked out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh my god, the trailer is so nice because I've not seen it before. So please show it to me before. Yeah, 100%. otherwise I'm gonna black out <laughs> again. What do you want to tell people about Darling in one line? Darling, July nineteenth. Me mundu gosundi. Must maza onda thandi. Mad Max marriage entertainer. Me intlo jarge, roj jarge katalu into tenches kondi. अलाव उन टाइम वाला तोड़ दिया, अच्छे से चुराने वाली पॉइंट, एन्जॉय चेक इट। थैंक यू आदि फॉर कमिंग। ओके, पोना इनका नहीं ना? इट वाज अ गुड वन। या, हाँ, या, थैंक यू। डायरेक्टिंग डालिंग, राइटिंग डालिंग। फर्स्टली आई वांटेड टू आस्क यू इज दैट वन क्वेश्चन दैट आई गोटन दिस ऑपरेशन how did you think of, like basically my uh, question is that you've written this split personality disorder and blended into an entertainer to convey this uh, specific topic in a very light hearted way so that every single common man can understand so how did you come up with this so <clears throat> the spark of it i don't know where it came from but uh, when when i started writing see as a writer we need we have responsibilities we need to tell something that we like but at the same time we are doing this on a very mainstream medium so we need to hold it on to make it make it a very big entertainer yeah. so only big 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 entertainers can teach you good things yeah, yeah, so yeah. on that note I, i had some questions all throughout my bringing up why is that when a man finishes work and comes home he just removes his clothes and sits and watches tv but a woman finishes work comes home and cooks and still gets scolding when the dinner is late why can't a man make his own tea why can't a man put his clothes to wash mm. why should he wait for the woman of his house to come and do it for him in spite of the woman having multiple things yeah. to do yeah. so but what i understood was women were masters in this uh, they could take care of everything um 
like they could be a mother they could be a teacher they could be a leader at the same time so they could do multiple things in one time men cannot do that so because men's life is simple we study we go to work we earn we give it at home we come remove our pants and shirt wear t-shirts then watch tv that's all <laughs> so this one point and still complain that women are tough to handle tough to understand yeah. they they are not letting us do this letting us do that yeah so i think uh, from darling it is just darling will tell you that you know if you put effort like what raghav did to understand anandi when he understood anandi he was a changed man he was a different man at home so like that we should also put efforts to do that <laughs> wow that's amazing that's beautiful thank you that's so good <laughs> like it's not just about the story it's not just about the movie correct you brought that essence of what actually a human being together as men and women are and put it into a beautiful entertainer <laughs> it's been a pleasure it's had been a pleasure working with you it's pleasure talking to you all the time yeah same so, yeah. <laughs> with that we'll wrap it up saying thank you everybody thank watch you the everybody. mad max marriage entertainer darling on july 19th in theater starring the wonderful naba natesh and the magnificent prayadarshi woo and directed by aswin ram <laughs> we are going to kill it you're going to see that bye <laughs> 19th of july darling to your nearest theaters please come and watch us and let us entertain you